This is Did You Do It Here? It's 8.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, June 10th, 2018. We are at the coloradostate.edu website looking at the Himawari 8 satellite imagery. This image represents June 10th, 2018 at 11.10 UTC. And I'm going to attempt to show you in a short, short amount of time why I'm here and how I found, found this. See what I did? I went to the uh, Colorado State website. All right. And uh, let me just back out. I had to do extraordinary measures to get that for you. Let's see, we'll go back over to the Go 16. And I was just looking at the uh, looking at the day, really. Looking at the energy first. Here we are. Go to accumulated group energy. And I was just checking out the ebbs and flows of uh, natural energy and seeing if we got any anthropogenic energy going on today. Looks like there is. Thought I'd zoom in on that later and check it out. But I wanted to see uh, by using overlays what kind of cloud uh, cloud cover and patterns and storms we got going on to see what we can attribute to natural you know storms took a while to get this thing going so you can see just normal springtime it's, it's, there's a lot of activity this time of year anyway and what I noticed first which was no big deal see Caught a glitch actually. Alright, well, what I did, I forgot to tell you. I did set it back to uh, June 9th at uh, 4 a.m. UTC. That's what I did. Okay. This is how I found it. Now, June 10th, end date. And, come on, fellas. $2,300. Okay, and then I hit the go button. And what I noticed was, let's see, I'm going to try to get it there for you. Okay, there it is. That. Okay. Well, that made me curious. 10.45 UTC, June 9th. 11 a.m. UTC, June 9th. Well, I think it's June 10th on the, other, on the other side of the world right now. And 11.15. 11 o'clock, 11.15. So it, it was about a half hour period. And what I did, I'm going to save some time. I went through every band, and it showed up on every band. Okay, so I went over to the... Uh, College of DuPage website just to do some confirmation and it also was in every band I set that on 200 frames I went through every band and every product and at the same time on the same date there was that uh, glitch okay so I went back over the goes and I scoured every band over there looking for some kind of other evidence on, on the GOES side. And I thought, well, let's go over to the Himawari side. So I went to the Himawari 8 side. And I went into, I got out of GeoColor. That's where they give it to you, so that's where you don't want to be. Went to uh, Natural Color. And I also did go back to the ninth come on now and I went to midnight and the end date was as current as I could get come on come on 
Well, this is the problem with this. There we go. $2,300. A little bit slow for me. Hit the go button. And start going. And I wanted to see that same time on June 9th. UTC. Well, what I did see was not at the same time on June 9th UTC on that side but I'm gonna go forward a little bit on the 10th over there I saw that at 8.30 a.m. UTC on June 10th 8.40, 8.50, 9 o'clock so nothing 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 we go forward to 10.40, 10.50, 11 o'clock, a.m. UTC, MORI 8. That, and look at that. I'm, you can't even see that, I know. But now you can, I hope. That's where he is up there, okay? Put some longitude and latitude on there. And I'm going to zoom in because I know as soon as we zoom in, going to aggravate me because it's going to take forever. See it? On the Himawari 8 side, got that zigzag pattern because, uh, you know, on the R side, you know, we blacked it out exactly on the horizon. They covered everything over there. J Japanese folks, they didn't give a shit. Okay, but there it is. I'm going to zoom in some more. That's why I caught that image for you in the beginning because it took a long time to get zoomed in and all clear. So somebody could put put it on their filters, get in their fancy program. And it had a kind of a reddish appearance and I didn't see any craters on it. But it could be a moon, I mean really. I'll go to Stellarium, I know that's a good place for someone who understands it. Well, folks, how you like that? Pretty cool. I like it. Let's do it.